I'm so not flexible. We're in our tent. The tent might not survive the night. Good morning guys, welcome back to a new weekly vlog. As you can tell, it is Saturday today. And I didn't vlog yesterday because I was extremely busy. Um, we had a worship night at church, which was the first time we could sing in church in over a year and a half. So I'm gonna insert some clips here, I think. But yeah, we are carrying on our weekend of activities at church. So I am heading to B&M this morning um, because I need to get a couple of bits and then straight up to church. I've got a session nine till 10 um, and then we are heading to the beach for baptisms, which is so exciting. I love a good baptism, um, but it's supposed to rain today. <laughs> Uh, we've literally had a heat wave all week and today's the first day it's like like I've got a jacket on like it's quite cold um so yeah hopefully we just need the rain to stay off and like the thunder and lightning and everything but um yeah I'm walking there now I'm so tired like beyond tired but it's okay it's okay <laughs> A road trip. <laughs> Good morning everybody, welcome to Sunday. I am extremely tired this morning, but we have church round one and I'll probably see you at lunchtime. Hi guys, it's um, much, much later than I anticipated. Um, it's now like, I was four or something. Um, I've just got back to church and I've basically, sorry, my whole breath have been up and down the stairs. Um, because I'm not here next Sunday, um, somebody's taking over for me. I just thought, um, I wanna make sure the room is like super tidy for them. So this is the current, state of the youth room there's loads of washing up that needs doing downstairs the bin needs emptying it just needs hoovering and just cleaning again so it's like ready um so yeah i'm gonna sort that out now um hopefully get it looking a little bit better for um the next sunday morning and yeah just needs to reorganize things have been put back in the wrong place so we'll sort that out hi guys it is the evening on monday um I have not had a very good day, if I'm honest. I've cried a lot. Um, I've cried a lot over the weekend, to be fair, but um, yeah, today's just not been very good. So, yeah, <laughs> I just, I'm not gonna pick up my camera when I feel like utter rubbish. Um, and I'm all for like sharing the negative side, but I'm not gonna like film me crying and like you know that's not fun to edit so um i've picked myself up a little bit um i'm still not feeling wonderful but noah's not here he's away for the night um it is like nine o'clock i think and i probably like i could have gone to bed at like half past seven i'm just feeling really rubbish but i was scrolling on tiktok and i found this girl who was talking about pelvic floor exercises and if any of you have followed me on instagram for a little while um you know i have touched on the topic of like a, a type of pelvic floor basically um and it's something that i struggle with and that i'm really trying to work on and she basically was just like going through really simple exercises and i'm like oh i really want to try that and it's something that women don't talk about and she actually shared that one in three women have like some sort of like pelvic floor issue 
um, which I just thought was really interesting because with my issues it's much smaller like it's like 5% of women will go through it um, whereas she was like one in three have an issue with their pelvic floor so should be doing exercises um, so I'm really determined and I'm feeling a bit motivated to like actually work on that tonight so I'm gonna put some like gym leggings on or shorts or something so I'm a bit more flexible than um jeans and I think essentially they're like stretches like yoga stretches or something um, but yeah I'm gonna do some of that now and I just thought I'll bring you with me because I've not filmed anything today so hopefully it'll be helpful to any of you that have never done any of this um and maybe like educate a little bit I guess of things that I'm going through but maybe that you're going through and you don't know that those things will help so um yeah I'm gonna show you some of the things that she said like are reasons to do it and walk through a YouTube video together I guess. I decided to move into the living room just because um all our floors are like um laminate and I thought it probably hurt um so basically the TikTok I watched was her TikTok handle is no such thing as TMI um, and she basically was talking about symptoms of a hypertonic pelvic floor and it's pain with this? <laughs> pain with tampons, pain with like a gynecology exam, vulva pain, tailbone pain, chronic QTIs, urinary urgency, urinary frequency, weak stream, incomplete emptying, constipation, uh straining to empty etc and for me like a lot of that is kind of where i struggle and, and i found this youtube video that uh is pelvic floor stretches for um kind of what the doctors have suggested i've got um so i'm gonna give it a go and we can all laugh together we've got um carpet in our living room uh not carpet a rug um so i just thought it would be easier but yeah you can you can join me making a fool of myself i'm so not flexible oh my goodness this is gonna be so hard i can't get i can't she is like lying down and i can't get any closer two minutes on this side Oh my goodness. This is giving a chance for a recoil, a gentle recoil of whatever. This woman is too stretchy. Honestly, I think that lady thinks I was like flipping Elastic Girl or whatever on. That was so hard. <laughs> I'm so not flexible and like my muscles are all so tight. But I'm really, really, really gonna try and keep up with it. Um, because it's one of those things that can only get better if I keep training my muscles so oh, I need to work on that um, I'm gonna make myself a cup of tea I think and watch some of Helen Anderson's vlogs in bed because she's been a bit of a guilty pleasure recently I used to watch her ages ago and then I always like watch her on and off um, but I've just really got back into her videos again so I'm gonna watch those um, it's funny like making videos i now see how much effort goes into certain styles of videos and like how they're done um that i really appreciate the ones that actually really add loads and take a lot of work um than people just that put videos together um yeah it's really interesting kind of seeing the other side of it so um i'm gonna make a tea and watch it in bed i think because i can because Noah's not here and oh i get to starfish he's just rung me bless him say he's put the tent up all by himself which i'm very impressed with um it's weird like I just get so used to obviously having him around and then he's not here i'm a bit sad and i don't really know if i'm gonna sleep <laughs> got my rainbow mug on my rainbow coaster lovely and look i was taking his pillows so I'm just gonna do that. Nice. Look who's here, everybody. He's back and home. I have done zilch today. Well, that's not quite true. I had a home visit this morning and had some work emails to do. Um, but quite honestly, just sat on the sofa and been sad all day. Um, so Noah's home and we've just ordered an Indian, which I'm very excited about. Kind of 
nervous for my stomach. Oh yeah. But I've taken my tablets, like they've said there's nothing wrong with me, so I can't avoid food forever, you know? Um so we'll just have to play it by ear. Maybe I'll just have to eat slower. And like maybe less. And gamma has gone up. And gamma's gone up. Um and it's like it's not spicy, it's a korma. Like they can't say that that's spicy. Anywho, that should be here in like the next 20 minutes maybe? Um, which I'm very excited about because I'm hungry now. And I think we're gonna try and have a date night. I've just turned my phone off and thrown it on the floor because I'm stressed. Um, and I don't need to be because I'm technically now on annual leave. So everybody should leave me alone. An absolute mountain of food. And we're gonna watch Captain America. What a feast and a date. Good morning, my dudes. Welcome to Wednesday. We are just leaving Plymouth. We're on our way to Creation Fest today. The uh, car is full of staff. We're leaving a little bit later than planned. Um, but the traffic is not ideal. It's moving though, which is different. Um, this is riveting content. Um, I... Mm, the traffic is moving. Is that what it sound like? Yeah. Nerd. Uh, I might try this out to do my makeup in the car. Um, or I might just let people see me without makeup on. Who knows? Um, weird, because I let a whole, you know... Internet. internet see me without makeup, but somehow and it's people you know and uh, the, ca the camera works wonders on a makeup plus face um i am heading there with noah now and um, there's a couple of things i need to check um at the site and then i'm gonna go and see my nephew and i'm so excited <sighs> i'm so excited are you excited i've not seen him in like six weeks only on FaceTime and now he's a big boy and he says lots of words and can do things like a show monkey and I've not seen it in person so I'm looking forward to seeing him. We were supposed to see my family a couple of weeks ago but somebody had to isolate and then not isolate so that was annoying um, but I'm glad we got to keep them safe just in case you were carrying the Rona. Um, what should be a, a 40 minute journey potentially is going to take us an hour and a half which is crazy um, just a lot of road works and stuff and holiday makers holiday ma it's the first week of, first week of the summer holidays and everybody wants to go to Cornwall <laughs> what's happening <laughs> <laughs> Look at you and your hivers. We're in our tent, which we've just thrown stuff in. But welcome to our home for the next couple of days. Oh, I am windswept. Um, we've just set up venues and stuff. What time is it? 4.52 um so both a bit knackered and my brain doesn't work right now I did however go see my nephew this morning which was lovely um and then probably got back here at about like half past one um and then just kind of haven't stopped since but Noah's been working all day and he's got lots to say right now um but I think we're just having a, a breather and then we'll head back to see people and have some food, I guess. Hello, my dudes. We have just done our Tesco trip of Christian Fest. I feel like we do one every year and it's like... It's like a highlight of our week. Yeah, it's like, I don't know. Well, we used to come as it's like... It's like a tradition. We used to come as teenagers and get like the three one pound sweets and <laughs> yeah. ice cream. Yeah. Whereas we've just... excursion. Yeah just got a couple of bits um thankfully this week we don't really need to think about food but um as noah said earlier i am the snack queen um which therefore means that i need to get snacks 
Um, and like just with the way my stomach is at the minute, it's good to have like a couple of a couple of things to eat. Like if I can't stomach <laughs> loads of food. <laughs> Um, but we're just heading back to the site now. Like, you can easily walk, um, but we're both so tired. And when you've got a car, why walk? Um, so yeah, it will, we'll literally be back in like 30 seconds. And then I think it probably won't be too long before we go to bed. My eyes are already shut. Yeah. So I think we're just gonna have a drink and a chill. Oh, oh my goodness. And some snacks. Look at that. Looks like I'm gonna tell a spooky story. <laughs> oh, that's so cool. Um today has been super busy. It is now late at night and um I don't know if you can hear, but our tent might not survive the night. Um if this vlog ever makes it, then I survived and I am living. <laughs> I'm gonna try and insert some videos of um, what our tent looked like. Guys, this is the, the top of our tent. I'm gonna die. Yeah, thank you so much for watching the weekly vlog. Sorry today was a little bit pathetic, but we're busy. Um, see you tomorrow in the next week.